Hey, 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 it's Sonia Hope all is well. We're going to talk today about how you can pull or extract email addresses from emails in bulk. Okay, now we came across this because we had a little snafu with our website here. And when we go to our contact section, yeah, this is a shameless plug. <laughs> Uh, we see that folks can enter uh, all of their contact information and then send them to us. And we opted to have these email addresses sent directly to our email address. So if I go back into my mail on Outlook, you're going to see here highlighted that we have a section uh, that we created specifically for uh, these kind of inquiries. And so what I'm going to do here First is preface, if anyone who comes across this video and you have a faster, more efficient, a better way to do this, by all means, put up the link to your site or the link to your uh, YouTube channel and we'll just learn together. Okay, all of us are on a learning curve and I have no problem with doing that. So what we're going to do here is to select every one of these emails. I have six. 146 okay I just selected control and a and then we're going to go into file and I'm working on Outlook 2013 okay just in case so yours might be a little different uh, go to open and export and then import export and once you do that you're going to get a pop-up menu like this and what you want to do is export to a file. You select next and then select comma separated values, also known as a dot CSV file. They're going to be extracting from this section and you double check because this is the name of our section here. Select next and then you can name this whatever you'd like, wherever you like. I always love to go to a uh, desktop because it's easiest to find then you're going to select next and it's telling us it already exists replace yes then it's going to ask you something else to map custom fields now outlook is going to provide these fields for me so i don't have to map anything and neither do you so then when you're finished you would select finish but I've already done this so let's see how it came out because it does take a while in order to uh, download so the raw file my raw file let me backpedal with this okay my raw file looks like this all right so it looks pretty neat doesn't it but as you scroll down you'll see something that looks like hieroglyphics okay and all I needed to do, I'm just going to control Y here. I cleaned it up by uh, just deleting that section and then deleting out all of the information that I do not need. So when I finished with that, my end product looks like this. And because I have no names here and I want to try to see how many of these emails are actually valid. Um, I just named them new subscriber because we're going to send them a new subscriber uh, welcome another one uh, that they received and we'll just see uh, if this list can be cleaned up which it probably will we'll probably get a few bounce backs we probably won't but um, at least we'll know which emails are valid and which aren't so that's how you would extract the emails but I do understand that some of you might have lists that are way more um, encrypted or uh, look more like hieroglyphics than mine did. And so for an easy solution, I'm going to point you to a friend that doesn't know he has a friend uh, on <laughs> YouTube because I got this from him. His name is Omar or Omar Sharif and I will not destroy this man's name but you see his name right down here and if you want to follow him go ahead if not that's fine we would prefer you follow us but you know knowledge is everywhere so I'm going to go back a little bit and I want you to go to 
um, your search on Google and plug in surf seven email extractor. Now let Omar tell you how to do this. Watch what he's doing. The options, I have also selected the option to lowercase all the emails. Now you press extract and it will take some seconds and you can find all those emails in that text content. All right. So that's what you would do. Let me turn myself down. <laughs> he was kind of low there. Um, so that's what you would do uh, if you were ready to... Um, you know, if your content is not as nice and neat as mine was. Okay. So again, that's how you extract email addresses from emails that you receive in bulk. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please do not hesitate to give me a call or give me a contact or give me an email or give me a shout out. Why don't you subscribe? Don't forget to follow us across social media at ECM Groups. Also, don't forget to visit our website at ecmgroups.com.